All right, first up will be the 3.1 grains of 231 under the 100 grain berries bullet. And we're about seven feet from the muzzle. Seven fourteen, seven twenty three, seven twenty three, seven nineteen, and seven seventeen. High of seven twenty three, low of seven fourteen. Average 718, extreme spread 9, standard deviation 3. The next five rounds will be 3.5 grains of 231, same bullet. I expect these loads to be a little peppier. 777, 803, 878, 809, 842. Since we had one shot that was way out of line, we'll delete that one. And now we'll look at them. High 878, low 803, average 833, extreme spread of 75. Standard deviation 34. Yeah, chances are we're going to get wet here. All right, it's laundry day here on the range. And we're going to crack off at those with a 45 automatic, 230 grain jacket at hollow point. I believe the bullets are by Winchester. First, we're going to take a shot across the chronograph to see how fast they're going. That well, came out at 805 feet per second. Okay, here we go. Splash fist. Fun, fun, fun. All right, our next two targets are milk jugs full of water. Bullet's gonna be a 185 grain jacketed hollow point, 45 ACP. Again, we're gonna shoot one round for the chronograph. Not bad. Now we're going to try a Spear Gold Dot Hollow Point, 230 grain factory load. Take a shot over the chronograph first and then we'll have at the jug. 794 feet per second. Okay, here goes the jug. Same bullet. We have Two more bottles up there. We're going to take a crack at them with the Hornady FTX self-defense type bullet. So this is a 90 grain flexible tip expanding bullet and it's going to be out of a 380 Ruger LCP. First shot will be over the chronograph. And then we'll go for the jugs. 922 feet per second. Well, as predicted, it started to rain. We're getting a little bit of a hailstorm right now. I'm sitting inside the car with the heater on. As soon as it slacks off a little bit, we'll be back out there. 46 degrees outside, wind's blowing about. Oh, 15, 20 miles an hour. 
So we're going to try a few 380 100 grain hard ball rounds at those two bottles. Alrighty then. Well, we left the applesauce jar sitting on the table. and see if I can take it off of there. There's a quick look at what's coming. It's going to rain some more here pretty soon. Those are the Owyhee Mountains on the other side of the Snake River. Still holding snow. Now we have a whiskey bottle full of water. We're going to take a crack at it with a Ruger American rifle. 22 long rifle chambering and CCI Stinger bullet. I frankly had higher expectations. Okay, we're gonna go left to right on these uh, two cans of tomato soup and one of diced tomatoes. CCI Stinger, Ruger American 22 long rifle. Before it gets raining really hard here, we're going to take those three out with the CCI Stinger Ruger American Rifle 22 Long Rifle Chambering. Alright, we got uh, no rain at the moment, so we're going to shoot CCI Stinger 22 Long Rifle out of the Ruger American chambered in that caliber. I'll shoot the water bottle in the can first. On the right we have a fresh can of refried beans. More fun than a barrel of monkeys. Alright, we're going to try to kick that refried bean can around a little bit. About right in the middle. <laughs> 